And now to this, it's been uh, long over two weeks since a young actor was shot and killed by thieves trying to steal his car's catalytic converter. Yeah, no one has been arrested for Johnny Wachter's murder, but friends, family, and others marched to City Hall demanding justice. KCAL reporter Jasmine Beal has more from downtown LA. A call to action Wednesday through the very streets in the area that Johnny Wachter called home. What do we want? Justice! When do we want it? Now! We were together, Sasha. The former General Hospital actor was fatally shot in downtown LA last month after he ended his late night bartending shift and surprised some thieves who were trying to steal his car's catalytic converter. I always thought he was invincible, so now. His brother Grant flew in from South Carolina to march from where Wachter was murdered on Hope to City Hall demanding justice and change. Protect my brother's memory and try and do the little part that I can to help out the, the people that he loved and cared about. Friend Micah Parker, who was working on a film with Wachter, spoke before the march explaining how he was thrust into this activism. Because of the indiscriminate, violent act of a selfish, cowardly individual and his accomplices. And I can confidently say that we are going to find you. Parker begged city and state leaders to do more to stop the violence. Los Angeles is in crisis. This is our home, and yet we walk these streets in fear and anxiety, not knowing whether or not we'll become the next Johnny Wachter in the news. The latest report from the LAPD shows catalytic converter thefts citywide have nearly been cut in half year over year, but this was murder. This is not right for someone to just walk up and shoot somebody to steal a part, a car part. Brian Barkley was the security guard who arrived minutes after Wachter was shot. It's the only street down here that doesn't have lights on it. It's a problem. It's that simple. I'm down here every night till 3 a.m. Could have been any one of us. So they marched. While police won't say how close they are to finding the suspects, not wanting to jeopardize their investigation. We have a number of leads. His family and friends promising, though, to keep up the pressure and to be a hero like Johnny was, who stepped in front of his co-worker when that gun was fired. Johnny Wachter's last act on this earth was the act of a hero when he stepped in front of his friend Anita Joy and took the bullet. Johnny's death was senseless and unnecessary. Here at City Hall, Councilmember Kevin DeLeon invited inside some of Wachter's family and friends so that they could honor Wachter's memory. Wachter's family wants to see at least a $25,000 reward for information leading to the suspects. Here in downtown LA, Jasmine Veal, KCAL News. And here at Four Big Ch